Right then, hello and welcome back to Toka Race Driver 2. We are on the 10th championship of the secondary career. And if we complete this one, we will have unlocked the first of the bonus championships, which is right at the end of the list, which we will do next time. But for now, we have the Euro Rally. We've only got the one car unlocked for this one. It's the Mitsubishi Lancer Evo 7. And we have four stages to do. Spain, one, two, three, and four. Very, very simple. Uh, we're just going to keep everything... Well, we can't change anything on this one anyway, because it's just stages. So it's going to take seven minutes and 42 seconds or thereabouts. So it's going to be a very short video, um, which would be great, wouldn't it? Um, yeah, we've only got one team as well and one livery, the uh, Danvers Rally Team, which isn't too bad at all. So short and simple then. Let's get on then with the first stage. One, go. I must admit, the rally stages on this game are a lot better than they are in Toka Race Driver 3. Um, the handling in uh, TRD3 on the rally stages, not the greatest. Oh, we're already behind by 1.8. Yeah, cutting a few corners. Need to make up some of the time. Oh, and not a strong start at all. 1.2 seconds down on stage one, which isn't great. So we're second overall. Uh, it was 1.29. It wasn't 1.3, you lying git. Uh, so we got 12 points for stage one uh, from Trevor Ubeer, which isn't too bad, I suppose. Anyway, stage two. Three, two, one, go. Over finish, and yes, by 2.7 seconds. Nice. Not too bad. So we've taken a lead of the rally at the moment, tied on points with Trevor with 27, and we've got two stages left to go. Stage number three. Three, two, one, go. Now that is my biggest problem with this rally car, is that if you keep it in second gear to try and pull yourself out of a corner, the revs just completely drop away and you have no acceleration at all. Yeah, if you keep it in first gear, the, the gearing isn't long enough, so you're just bouncing off the rev limiter all the time, which is really bloody annoying. Three left and three left. Long 
Okay, nice, made up some time. Be unsettled there. Three left. Come on, get going. No. Ooh, come on, get to the finish. Just about point seven. Bloody hell. Oh, that was a bit touch and go at the end there. And there we go, then that is stage three complete. And we, yeah, by 0.71 of a second, we won that stage by. So we have a 42 to 39 points lead at the moment, but uh, we still got one stage to go. And uh, hopefully, we should do, uh, hopefully, quite well. All right, three, two, one, go. Oh. Let's get over the start finish line and yes by point eight Bloody hell uh, the thing is with these stages is that they're very uh, the car gets very unsettled in course with without the acceleration as well in second gear You're just very very sluggish coming out of the corners, but anyway, we kick Trevor's ass So get in there 57 to 51 so we win the championship Which is absolutely awesome and with that we should let's have a look Nope, not time trial, that's not what I want. Uh, stay on hard. So we've completed the Euro Rally. Next is the Duez Trophy. Great. Uh, but that means we have unlocked the complete 10 championships to unlock. I've just completed 10 championships. That is the 10th one. Come on. Why ain't it giving it to me? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That is the 10th championship. How bloody stupid. Oh well, I guess we haven't unlocked the first bonus championship then. We'll have to wait for now. Uh, so yeah, next time then is the Duez Trophy. And then we have the Bowler Rally Cross. We're in the, uh, the rally section now. Uh, before we get back into the nitty gritty of the stock car championship. Uh, so yeah, there we go then. That is the, uh, the Hella Euro Rally complete. And next time is the Duez Trophy. So I'll leave it here for now. Thank you very much for watching as always. 
and I'll see you next time. Take very good care.